Hi, hello and welcome to Designer by Design. Today, we are going to see how to work with 3D models and maybe create a short animation scene with 3D models. First, let's see how to bring 3D models into your slide. From the insert menu, click 3D models and then select stock 3D models. PowerPoint provides few preloaded 3D models. For this example, let's select the dinosaur 3D model. This is an animated 3D model. You might have noticed the new 3D model menu when you select the 3D model. They provide options to view from different angles. You may click on those to see how the model behaves. Check out this side view, top view, back view, and bottom view. If you note, there is an icon in the middle that you can use to drag and rotate 360 degrees in any angle that you want. The other option to check out is Scenes menu. All animated models come with different scenes. The first scene was running. Check out the scene number two. This looks like it's hunting or eating. Let's check the next scene. Wow, it's roaring effect. Next scene. Oh, that's a big blow. The last scene. Oh, it's just looking around for food maybe. All right, for this example, let's use scene number one. Here, the dinosaur is running. Wouldn't it be great to use this scene to have the dinosaur chase any other animal? Let's find out what other animals we have. A bird. And here is a rhino. Let's see what scenes are available for the rhino. Scene 1 is just standing and shaking head. Scene number 2 seems to be walking. Scene number 3 it's running. This is what we need. Let's create a scene as like the dinosaur is chasing the rhino and the bird is maybe cheering the rhino. Okay, now let's resize the bird and the rhinoceros to a relative height when compared to the dinosaur so it looks more realistic. Okay, now let's make sure the dinosaur and the rhino are aligned to the bottom. For this, we need a background to make it realistic. From the insert menu, select picture and click online pictures. Search a suitable landscape with a road. I found this one. Send the landscape picture back. Now we see that the dinosaur and the rhino are running on the road. What would make it more realistic is if the landscape behind them keeps moving, right? So let's duplicate the landscape image and concatenate it.
Now from the animation menu, apply line motion effect. Just like this. Set the start as with previous and the duration as 20 seconds. Also, try formatting the background color as black to give the cinematic effect. Okay, we are done here. Let's check out the animation. I hope you enjoyed this video. For more such useful videos, subscribe to Designer by Design. See you in another video. Bye now.